A convicted killer is ordered to spend the rest of his life behind bars for a deadly drive-by shooting in Providence, but the suspect insists he's an innocent man. Eyewitness News reporter Susan Campbell is live in our newsroom now with details that are new at 5. Susan, Devin Letourneau was sentenced to serve two life terms for killing Manny Hilario back in 2010. The victim's family says they're grateful for the strict sentence, but today Letourneau stood up in court and told the judge he wasn't the trigger man. Two life sentences 20-year-old Devin Letourneau sentenced to two consecutive life terms for killing Manny Hilario in what investigators call a gang-related drive-by shooting in Providence in 2010. I'm just happy, you know, Justin has been said, everybody's happy. In Superior Court, the victim's sister, Catherine Hilario, spoke on behalf of her father. I know that all the money in the world will never tear my son, but I know that if we all pray for him, God will have a special place for him. I also hope that the person that did this to my son will repent so God can forgive him. But Letourneau isn't apologizing for the crime. He maintains his innocence, claiming the state withheld evidence during his trial. And I will get my freedom back. A painful claim for Manny Hilario's friends and family. I was awestruck that he would actually have the audacity to say something so pathetic and disgusting on his behalf. He was proven beyond a reasonable doubt, no questions asked, that he was actually the one who did this. Devin Letourneau is awaiting a trial on unrelated charges involving a robbery and a home invasion. Live in the newsroom, Susan Campbell, Eyewitness News.